don't want to do that. Right. Well, the, it, it's also makes people sick. Uh, it yeah. also, you know, a lot of problems. And, and that's mostly based off uh, uh, frame rate. Uh, so, like, if you're you're using something that is poorly made, like software, like a an app, and you put it on and it's the frame rate's shit, then you're just going to get sick immediately. Or is it too low a frame rate? Yeah, too low a frame sick? rate, you start getting sick. So it just confuses you. Yeah, it just makes you feel like uneasy, like you know when you're spinning on a carnival ride right. or something, and your stomach starts getting. Little. That makes sense. Of where if your mind, if your eyeballs are seeing something that's blurry and fucked. Your mind might say, "Oh my God, you're sick. You should throw up." Exactly. You exactly. ate something bad. You're dying. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And s here's something I I'll show you. It's tough. There's not a lot of content, and Facebook may be fucking up by not showing this stuff more. So Canon made this dual fisheye lens. It's, I'm pretty sure it's the only one that's out there right now. Right. That allows you to shoot content to be watched in these headsets, mm -hmm. and when it's done right, which hasn't been done right very much, but when it is done right, it's fucking amazing. It is wild how cool it looks, but it's not a lot to look at right now, and you, you have to put the headset on to see it. Right. But it, things in front of you look like you should just reach out and touch them, and they're in high-definition quality. It seems like every iteration of these things, we're always waiting for the one that's like, that's it. Like, if you go back to when VR was first talked about, it was like the 80s and 90s. Remember, they thought that that was going to be mm -hmm. a thing. You put on the goggles, you're in another world. But technology wasn't really there. And then all of a sudden with Oculus and with the HTC Vive, okay, we're getting real close. Now we're getting real close. But it's still, like, not quite. That that's what they, that's what the they, 90s. Yeah, that, that's yeah. what they think Apple is going to do with their headset, It might that it's going to be that cool, supposedly. So this is VR in the 90s. So yeah, this, they probably this. thought, this is the beginning. We're getting ready, and this is this is going to be the yeah, future. And even to use this, you had to be in a big pod, like those the pods we almost want to use now, but the pod was just to track you. Like if you went out of the pod, it wasn't reading you. Anything inside the pod, it read. Mm. And you had to have all sorts of cables and wires and things connected to you. Still, though. Where did they have this at? They had it at Kosai. Uh, okay. So this is in the 90s, and yeah, here we are, there. 2023. Like, yeah. It's it's still not quite. You, you would have thought that would have taken off. I forgot about that. Yeah, that's what the guy. That's what the headset looks like. Which they still have these things in you know arcades yeah. all over the place. The graphics got a little better. But one of the things they think they're going to be able to do is recreate psychedelic experiences. They they think they're going to be able to make a VR psychedelic experience so you could trip balls without having to do any drugs and it'll have the same effect on your mind. I do it a pretty good version of it like all the time. Yeah. Yeah. The thing I play all the time, I have a character that you could do DMT, acid, mushrooms and stuff like that and you take it and you start start seeing a little bit of trails on your hands and then the more you start seeing more trails like it's pretty good and you could do dmt where there's like fucking like buddhas coming out of the ground like like that look like lasers and shit like that. Really? yeah it's sometimes we'll just listen to music get high and just do that for hours <laughs> and what 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 are you using what is this uh, it's this looks like unreal oh, but wow. someone's made a sh oh. shroom trip it yeah looks fun. Oh. yeah oh wow this really? just goes on for a few minutes yeah there's just different visuals and stuff how many grams would you say that is? Yeah, see, oh, I love that lighting effect where it's like clouds, shadows. Whoa. Maybe this is a real video, then they fucked with it. Yeah, I think this, this is, is a real dog. Yeah, they, yeah, this is a real video. <laughs> the dog uh, knows you're tripping. That's cool. So what are you using? I, I'm using VR chat, which is like the good version of what Zuckerberg's trying to do. And VR chat is connected how? Like you're using it's, a it's, PC? It's free. You could actually use an Oculus for it. You're not going to get that great of graphics, but I'm using like a really high end PC and a Valve Index headset. And uh, it's a VR chat's free. And it's kind of like, you know, you just download it, you make your character or whatever, and then you go, hey, I want to go to Disneyland, or hey, I want to go by a, on a beach, you know, and you just type in beach, and it's like wow. Google, and they'll show you all the worlds you can go to. And Whoa. Then you go there, meet up with your friends, you know, do acid on the beach or whatever. And the graphics are really high end? <laughs> oh, yeah. It's, it's, there's, you know, it's, 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 each level is made by a different person, so there's like good versions of it and bad versions of it, realistic versions of it. So this is like the real cutting edge. The, yeah, this is what this is what you know. This is way more popular times a lot, you know, than Zuckerberg's stuff. Really? And this like is like how many people are using this? Uh, it's one of the high, largest uh, user base of, of a multiplayer game on Steam. Yeah, there is another thing which mm. I don't like. You're you're hung up on that headset. You don't 
maybe today you do, but you're not going to have to use the headset. You'll be able to play with me and Brian if we have our headsets on just through a browser like this. Like you oh, you can do play. that right now. Yeah, you yeah. don't have to put the headset yeah. on. Oh, so you can play it like a video game. Yeah, 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 or a chat room. Now, what is the best version of graphics? Like these things are all made by different people, right? Yeah, so yeah. what's the best version? So if, if I were to uh, play this <laughs> right now with you, I have bookmarked like all these worlds. So like I have the best world to go to if you want to be in a beach, best world if you want to be on the moon, best, you know, oh. so... Uh, like, look at this bar. You can. This kind of has good lighting and stuff, but you know, it almost looks like a nice, realistic bar. Uh, and look at that character. See, like that's somebody that scanned themselves. It looks like. Yeah. Uh, uh, obviously. Yeah. How weird. And so you now you look back at what we were just watching with Zuckerberg's, you know, metaverse, and it's so silly compared to this. You know, like graphic wise, it's like you can be anything in it you want. Yeah, but isn't the metaverse stuff, the the Zuckerberg stuff, capable of doing things like this? Yeah. It's just it, it may, it, that's why people why it's not working though. Like, look at that. That looks like a real ice bin for popsicles. You know, like at a convenience store. You know, that's not the graphics you're seeing on on Zuckerberg. Zuckerberg's is very cartoony, very kids kind of feely. You is, know? But that, is that for all of them or just different software applications? Well, like you could play this on the headset. You know, but the metaverse it, it, is the Facebook. Like they're trying to get you into that metaverse world, and that's what's failing. But it's other stuff in the metaverse, like with those the Oculus that they're ha that they have. Um, they have these virtual tours. Yeah, you... yeah, but that's not that, that's not like the metaverse. That's like you, you can pl you can play the headset's just like a computer, pretty much. So you can download anything on it. You know that or so the metaverse is like a walled garden. Metaverse is like what we were just watching in VR chat, where it's kind of like a chat. Get that's together the with real friends. metaverse. But what, what Zuckerberg was trying to do, you're saying, is like a walled garden. Like they were making it very specific to th these apps. They were going to have these kind of cartoony things. Right. It's it, it's it, The metaverse is doing it through all these characters and, and stuff like that. I don't know. It's hard to – it's so hard to explain because it's uh, – they made it confusing as fuck, you know? But if anybody can't explain, if you can't explain it, nobody can explain it. Right, you're, you're, and you that's a that lot shit. of the problem, you know? It, it, it's VR's taking off, the metaverse is just not taking off because Facebook wants you to live inside their world, you know? 